But those of you who are taking listening, speaking, wanted to give you some suggestions about currently how you can go about finding out what are we going to do today? What did we do yesterday or last week? And so currently we're working in Microsoft Teams and here above we have different menus, one of which has a drop down menu with a lot of different options. Okay, so I want to share with you today really three different tabs that you might find useful. Okay, these are optional, but these are all intended to help you find out what are we doing today, what did we do last week, what did we do in prior weeks. All right, so the first option here, tasks, here at the bottom. This is going to give you a list of different tasks that we've completed so far in the course as well as the course or the uh, topic or activity or task that we're doing today. So here you see basically two categories, one called current and a second here below called done. So current are the ones that we are currently doing. Usually within the week I will leave these open. These are the tasks or the uh, assignments activities that we have done or are doing currently and below are those that we've completed all right so if this helps to see at a glance the current activities and those that we've completed along with the dates that we have completed each of the tasks so the due dates represents when we completed the tasks so in combination with the due dates and these categories or these statuses current and done you can I think easily find the tasks that we've completed. Now another way to view these same tasks is to go to the calendar view. So again I'm going to select here more. There's a drop down menu and I'm going to select calendar and this is going to give us a different view of the same tasks. Now here it's by default it's going to uh, go to week. You can always select month view if you want to see the month view. But here you can see each day the activities along also the, the time in which we completed each of the tasks here in this weekly view. If we go to the monthly view, of course, this is what it looks like. Um, but you can easily see each of these tasks, click on each task, go into the task, and get more detail about what it covers. Let me go back because I didn't show that here in the task view. Let's go back to the task view. Again, you can also click on the task to get more detail. So we can click on a task here and we can see the details and the activity. Basically the activity is just any changes that were made to the task will appear here as well as comments. Right? So if I post any comments here they will, they will appear in the activity under details of course here you can see uh, details about the activity. Okay, so the calendar view and the task view I think are two important and perhaps useful views of what we're doing in class. Now the last thing I'll share here, docs, this is going to be more uh, information that relates to the class. We may reference it in class, we may not. Many of the activities will be listed here. Um, I'm still working with this page so just you can come by and visit this page and see if this is useful for you um, but we have some additional information here that uh, are not or that is not going to be found in uh, the task view all right so again I think tasks and calendar view these are going to be I think the most useful of course you can still access the video archive so if you need to go back and review anything that we talked about in class then this is going to be where you can view all of the past videos. Our intention or my intention is to always record the classes. Sometimes I'm successful, sometimes I'm not as we had some issues this week but ideally we have all of the classes recorded and then any tutorial videos or any suggestions that I'm making I'm also creating videos and keeping those here within this playlist. Okay, so again, you can access this uh, video archive here, or you can easily just save the the playlist on your uh, on your browser. So I hope this helps. If you're interested in trying to find out what we're doing for the day or what we've done in the past, check out these two views.
the calendar view, and the test view.